Well, we expect a briefing from Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu and other officials shortly. We'll bring you that live as it happens. In the meantime, one Israeli city not under lockdown yet, but could be heading there, is Renana. It's a town with a strong English-speaking community, which saw an outbreak of over 150 cases, in part due to one school graduation party. Well, our correspondent Emily Rose is in Renana. And Emily, Renana may be uh, the demographic there, a little different from some of the other hot spots we've been seeing until now. And I guess it show, goes to show you no community is immune from this pandemic. That's quite true, Kalev. Ordinarily, when we speak out here in the field, often even in the past weeks, we've been in communities that are ultra-Orthodox, religious, or perhaps even of a lower socioeconomic class. But here in Ra'anana, this is considered to be one of the higher socioeconomic class levels in the country. And as you mentioned, it features a wide array of immigrants, mostly from the United Kingdom and South Africa. Earlier today, I spoke with Andy Album. He's the chairman of a very large synagogue of about 400 families. He said over 90% of which are from either the United Kingdom or South Africa. So they are an Anglo-speaking community. And I asked him about the hardships of the, com the community is going through over the past few weeks uh, with the coronavirus crisis and what it's been like here in the city of Renana. So take a listen to what he told me. We had a bereavement in our community. Actually, our founding member, the person who founded the shul, um, he passed away. His wife's here, but he has a daughter in London. Of course, there's virtually no flights from the UK. She wasn't able to make it in time for the funeral, which was this afternoon. I don't think she'll be here for the shiver either. We have another member, sadly her father, who lives in Johannesburg, passed away this morning. She's here. Her sister's in London. Her father was in Johannesburg. They watched the video on Zoom, and she's sitting shiver all by herself, and her sister is all alone in London. 